Hey guys, it's Megan. Welcome back to my channel. Let's take a look at some Adopt Me news for the brand new winter 2023 update. Who is excited to visit the Winter Village? So we have a title confirmed. It's the Winter Village. As we can see, you hop on the train and you get taken to the Winter Village. So we can see, what, what can we see? <gasps> wait, wait, wait. Oh my gosh, we actually can see some pets. Look guys, there's a cookie bat dragon. I'm sure that was already in the works. Oh, look, and then there's a little chickmunk wearing like a, su a suit. Or he's like a nutcracker chipmunk, which makes sense because he's a chipmunk. And what is this? What do you think that is right there? I can't really see. It looks like a little beluga whale, but I don't really know how that would be Christmassy. So are you guys seeing that? That's super exciting. Wow, okay, okay. They've also shared this really adorable little imagery of the Arctic Express. So you get on the Arctic Express and then you go to the Winter Village. <gasps> Wait, okay, look right here. Do you see that? I think it's a beluga whale, but I can't tell. What do you guys think that is? He's hopping around, he's doing some backflips, like a little seal. And they've also teased this vehicle, which is a huge snow globe that you can ride around in. So it might be a legendary vehicle, which is exciting. Now inside this, we have the little, we, we have a little squirrel guy. What is that? That's the red squirrel, the red squirrel. I can't, I can't, what is that? The tanuki? I don't know, what, what is that pet? I can't remember, I can't remember the name, but it's not a new pet. Now let's see if we can see anything else in the background here. As we can see, we have the Arctic Express right there that takes you to the Winter Village, which is very exciting. Um, just this background stuff is the penguin ice skating rink, which will still be on Adoption Island. And I'm not seeing anything else, but this is such a cool vehicle. I love it. So we're looking at a Nutcracker Chipmunk, a Beluga Whale, and some sort of Brownie Cookie Bat Dragon. But I have, you know, decided to make a couple more ideas because I don't think it's too late to submit for, you know, a chance at having an idea that makes it into the Adopt Me 2023 update. I kind of feel like I want to keep it a secret of what I'm building and you guys can guess as we go. It'll be like a big reveal. As we can see, we're in my, my thumbnail, my thumbnail area. Um, this is where I make thumbnails. Let's put our winter background on. And let's start with our first pet, or maybe I should start with the second one. Regardless, I'll crop this guy out. We'll go ahead and do the work for that. This little tail, so cute. Okay, so we have our first one, and I'm only gonna be making two. I'm gonna be making two today. Last time I did three, and I felt that three, it just, I, I was like, I don't know, do people like all three? So let's just stick with two. Plus, we've already gotten a reveal of some of the pets coming. The way that I was also tagged in this, I saw this cookie bat dragon. That's making place idea pet for Christmas, not an idea that's real. Now, this is this is funny because this is obviously what they're teasing. So it looks like it is a cookie bat dragon. I made a gingerbread bat dragon. My idea looked totally different than this, but I'm really proud of myself. I was on the right track. I mean, we even have this photo right here. Is this like in the game? Am I being so silly right now? Hold on a second. I have to go into Adopt Me and see. Because I was in Adopt Me over the weekend and I didn't see anything of the sort. No, no, see, nothing's there. Nothing's there. Hmm, but here we can see like that, like I'm just so confused. Like how did they get this image? Okay, back to business. The very first one I'm gonna do is, okay, and first I have to put a watermark because one time I made a video like this and then somebody just like literally like stole, like they copy and pasted my stuff into their thumbnail and they didn't give me any credit. No credit, ta. Not even like, oh, this cool pet concept by Megan Place. They just like didn't even mention it. They just like used it for their thumbnail and then that was it, so now we gotta put a watermark. Okay, <laughs> this first idea is so silly. Like anybody could recreate this. And so my first idea is, ooh, that looks really cool. Add some white. That does not look good. Oh my goodness. Don't judge it yet, don't judge it yet. Cleaning this up a bit. Um, The white is not looking good. Basically the idea is instead of a blazing line, you have a frozen lion. Huh? Huh? Now, I like, I don't know. I'm, I like to think I'm okay at Photoshop, 
but I don't know how to make this part white. I mean, I guess I could mess around with it some more. I just don't, yeah, that's not gonna do anything. It's just black is really hard to change, just like white is really hard to change because um, black is the absence of color. In art, it's all the colors put together. In science, it's the absence of color. But in science, white is all the colors put together. And in art, it is the absence of color, making it hard to alter both of these tones, colors, shades. <laughs> Oh my gosh, okay. So I could go to replace color and select the black, but I don't even know. I mean, that kind of worked. We'll take it. We'll take it, guys. The blazing, I mean the frozen lion. Yay! On to the second. This one is going to be, I think, a little bit easier to make. Just be, like, and it's so silly. I came with so many ideas. I was like, oh, this will be so cool if we do it this way or if we do it this way. Let's try this. The other way I was doing it was not working. I was trying to make like some saturation, but it just was not doing what I wanted it to do. Um, this is barely, oh my gosh, this is barely doing what I wanted to do. I am just not with it today, guys. I, like why, it should just not be this hard to turn an orange cat into a brown cat. Okay, I feel like we're getting somewhere. It's very okay. Like it, it you kind of start to get the little like scratchies. That's the only way I know how to describe them around like the eyes and stuff. Cause I'm like just messing with it. Like just being like, well, how do I, like, I don't know. Okay, I think that's the best I can do with the color. Does this look brown or does this look orange? They look the same to me. <laughs> Um, we'll take it. I would now like to remove the cat's stripes. Say goodbye. Now, I will say this idea was a lot better yesterday whenever I originally thought of it. And now I've seen what Adobe already is coming and it seems like a silly idea. Maybe not silly, but definitely like lazy. And I already picked a lazy pet. Um, all right, let's see. How do we want to put these on? Like this, this. Okay, let's put them like, this is the chocolate chip kitten. <laughs> I mean, it's kind of cute, you know, like I think it's really adorable. We're still obviously messing with it. We're still. Add in some little chocolate chippies here and there. But look how cute. Oh my gosh, he looks like a little cheetah. Okay, so as we can see, he has a little chocolate chip nose and then he's got, you know, chocolate chips on him. And it, like originally I wanted to call him the cookie kitten, but I feel like the chocolate chip kitten is better, but it's also not really giving Christmas. It's kind of giving dessert, which is where I eat the most desserts is during Christmas and holiday time. Um, so, I mean, Cookie Bat Dragon, what does that have to do with the holidays, right? So if we're doing a Cookie Bat Dragon, not the Gingerbread Bat Dragon, even though I think that was a better idea. I'm just gonna say, just thought that was better. We're doing a chocolate chip kitten. And maybe you could even add a Santa hat. A little Santa hat, cause that is cute. Aww. Yay. We can't even put one on the blazing, or the, the, I'm sorry, the frozen lion. Put it on the frozen lion. Perfect, amazing. Have you ever seen any two pets so wonderful? I know I haven't. So, thank you guys for watching today's video. If you loved it, don't forget to like button, subscribe button, leave a comment down below, and any ideas you have for future pets. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will talk to you guys next time. Bye.